Hi everyone and welcome back to the old so and so. So after about four weeks, I can finally say that this trailer is packed and ready for Petals from the Past, Antiques in the Garden in Jemison, Alabama, April 19th and 20th. I can't tell you how relieved I am that it is all done. Um, I don't think there's anything else I need to add. Um, I have my table stuff ready. I have crates for my tables. Tables, chairs, a little bit of everything. So I'm gonna turn this camera around and let you see um, what the trailer does look like. Now remember now, we have a 40 by 40. So, hold on. Okay, we have baskets, garden tools, little pots, galvanized, rolling pins, baskets full of whatever I could come up with. Even these, um, the peg things, I have got iron stone, hats, picnic baskets, um, architectural stuff, ladders, signs, um, just about anything that you would want to even put in a, a garden. I mean, that's pretty good. Um, let me step back away from the trailer. So, I would say that that is definitely three-fourths full. I mean, I could have filled it up to the top, but I'm also thinking about how many steps it's going to take to get all that stuff up the hill. We got a chicken coop, shutters, headboards, footboards, and you're probably wondering why those they are great to put out in a garden. You can put baskets over them, the hand tools, you know, use those as trellises. I've got the crates. Um, I even have, I even have a dress form, little chairs, big chairs, tables. I don't know. I have it so packed, I can't reach any further. And I even put some of those, um, those, um, uh, some kind of, I don't know what kind of molds they are, but I think you can use them for, um, um, to stack stuff on, risers. Alrighty. Alrighty, what a load off of my shoulders. Um, you know, I can't think of any, I'm sure I could add and add and add, but um, I'll probably do a last look around the house to make sure um, if there's anything that I think I could put in there. Um, my hydrangeas are coming up. I'm so glad. Um, I do have plows, but they're too big. Um, my neighbor's gonna pass by. He's probably like, well, what are you doing? Um, I don't know. I think, I think I've got everything that I want to take. Um, I got some wheelbarrows. Um, but I think that's it. Um, the next thing I need to do is work 
in the flower beds. Um, the dandelions, boy, I tell you what, we've got the dandelions. I can't grow plants very well, but I can grow weeds and dandelions. Alrighty guys, um, it's definitely getting close to dinner time. And I've got to close up that trailer. Um, tomorrow's another work day. So, um, trailer's pretty easy. And um, you know Todd's gonna be driving it. Not me. It'd be like one of those things. Get off the road! <laughs> Alrighty. Oh. So, stay tuned for more videos. Um, I want to work on um, my back deck. Um, it definitely... It definitely needs some sprucing up, cleaning up, but it's a pretty big deck. It's pretty large. Um, I don't know if I've ever shown you the deck from the backyard. I don't go in my yard very much, but this is the reason why we bought this house. Look how, it's, it's really a perfect area. Nice, large, um, the porch, the original porch was very small, but um, I want to do some stuff around the house. I've got something special that I'd like to make here. And it's just out of terracotta pots. So I hope you stay tuned. So I guess that's it for the day. I will definitely see you in the next video. And if you're anywhere close to Jemison, Alabama, I would love to meet you. Um, they do have a... Um, uh, YouTube meet and greet on the Saturday. So, um, if you get a chance, I think it's, uh, petalsfromthepast.com. But, um, I will talk to you later. Bye.